Welcome guys You're watching another episode of Mechanics on Duty Today we're gonna show you guys how to mount and balance tires We have a customer who has bad tires This was because of a bad alignment You can see the wiring is out on this one Couple of things before we begin this uh, show First thing you're gonna make sure the tire size let me get a my, let me get my light. First thing you want to make sure the tire size is the same, 175, 70 or 14. Okay, that's the old tire, and uh, this is the new tire, 175, 70, 14. R 14 is a radius. That's the diameter from here to the other end, the rim size. If that's not the same, this tire is not even gonna fit onto the old rim so you gotta make sure at least the 14 has to be the same or if this uh, tire size was the rim was a 15 17 18 16 so you gotta make sure the tire size is correct before doing anything we are gonna deflate the tires so we're gonna remove the core from the stem and then we're gonna remove the weights the wheel weights and then we're gonna break the bead with that machine right there we're gonna break the bead and then dismount the tire and then we are gonna mount the new tire onto this rim and then we're gonna balance this okay and let's get start doing that so we're gonna begin with deflating the tire we're gonna remove the the core in the stem so what we do is we remove the stem and all the air will come out And we're gonna do the same thing with the other tire. We're gonna mount and balance both of these tires. Next, we're gonna remove the wheel weights of both men. Next, we're gonna remove the wheel weights. That's the tool you use, that's a real weight hammer, and also it removes the weights. Opposite side, same thing. This one has no weight on the opposite side. And neither does that one. Okay, that's done. Now we're gonna break the bead on this with the tire machine. Okay, so the machine is gonna break the bead. gonna break the bead on both tires Next, we're going to dismount the tire. You can use some of the slick to move the tire so it doesn't grip since it's a plastic. You can use the tool, the bar to lift up the tire. And then and the machine will do the rest. Same thing with the bottom bead. You grab, lift. Use the bar to lift the bead up. And the machine will turn it out. Yeah, turn, turn, turn. 
and the tire comes right off. You use the same liquid to lube up the tire a little bit so it slips better on the machine. in place now you can inflate the tire up to 35 psi Put the core back in its place so it holds the pressure. And you put the valve cap back on. And this tire is mounted. Now we're gonna do the second one. Same procedure. A little bit of the slick lube. The duck head goes on the rim. Make all the adjustments necessary so the rim don't get damaged. You grab the bar, lift up the bead, and the machine. One bead is out, he's gonna grab the second bead, the lower bead, and the tire will be dismounted. A little bit of slick and the tire is ready to go on the renew run PSI. You're gonna put the core back and the cap and that's it, the tire is mounted and is ready to be balanced. to balance the tires you put the tire on the balancer you use the centering hub lock it up We're gonna enter the specs on this wheel first we're gonna measure the width of the rim which is 5.5 5.5 we're gonna enter that on the machine the 
Then there has another measurement. And then the last one is the rim size, which is a 14 inch. And the machine is ready to balance this tire. So this tire needs uh, 50 grams on the inner edge and 125 on the outer. Right, to put this weight, you have to line the mark 12 o'clock and then put the weight at 12 o'clock, exactly right on the top. 125. Same thing with the inner edge, which is a 50.5 at 12 o'clock. Now we're gonna let this rotate and see what the numbers come out to. Zero, zero. This tire is perfectly balanced. You're gonna remove this tire and put it back in the car and that's the tire is done. Now we're gonna do the second tire. Put the hub, centering point, lock it up. In this case, we don't have to enter the specs. It's the same size, same rim, same tire, same thing. So we're gonna let this roll and see what kind of numbers we get. This one is 1.50 and a one. So same thing at 12 o'clock, we're gonna line up the marks. 12 o'clock, that's the outer edge. Straight at 12 o'clock. And now we're gonna do the inner edge. Same thing. 12 o'clock. machine spin and let's see if you get lucky and this bounces out on the first try oh we didn't get so lucky so that's a good numbers 0 0.50 0 0.25 we're gonna find those numbers and come right back okay so we're gonna do the same thing 0 0.50 12 o'clock And then same thing on the outer edge, 0 0.25. We are gonna let this spin and see if it zeroes out. There you go, perfectly zeroed out balanced tire. And that's how you mount and balance tires.